What a fantastic performance, fantastic result. It's brilliant. I mean, can't believe we've, uh, we've got through that game. It was a tough game. Personally, not my best game. I don't think the team played the best football we can, but we got through the test. You know, fitness helped us massively. We got through another 120 minutes today. We've got through that <coughs> huge test. And we've all stuck together as a team, which is the main thing. And that's how we've got through at the end of the day, I think. Mm -hmm. Liverpool were strong favourites, so what was the secret then? Well, we had a, a game plan which we've worked on all week, which, you know, credit to the coaches for, uh, for setting that out and watching their games and helping us get that game plan. Tried to, stop, tried to double up on the uh, wingers, stop them getting crosses in and stuff like that. But, you know, as the game went on, we, uh, we went, when we went 3-2 up, we managed to sit back and keep, keep tight, keep the defence tight and restrict them to chances, which was how we won it again. Mm -hmm. One thing about this group of players, it's not just the ability, it's the ability allied to the desire and you showed ferocious determination to make sure you, you won tonight. Yeah. Well, I've always said it, there's something about the, the group of lads in there that they give everything for each other, which is a brilliant asset to have for all of them. I mean, we, we all die on that pitch for each other and when, you know, when things don't come off personally and for the team, we can guarantee that everyone, you know, the person next to you is giving 100%, they'll be helping you. When you make a mistake, they'll be helping you, which is the best thing we can ask for, really. Mm -hmm. And what's it like, the feeling is like to score a winning goal? It's, it's unbelievable to be honest, I mean, getting back in the changing room then, the celebrations we just had, it's something I'll, uh, I'll never forget and, you know, looking at my phone and seeing texts and stuff off my uh, mum and dad and, and girlfriend, it's brilliant to see, you know, mm -hmm. a proud moment. As you said, the ball came to you, but you still had to finish it off, but very cool, composed when you slammed it home. Yeah, well, I saw the, uh, the ball fall to me, there was two defenders on the line, I think, for just smash it through the middle of them and it went in luckily I didn't really know what to do when I uh, scored just ran around and went, bad, went mad but we got the job done at the end of the day so that's all I could ask for and none of you showed any nerves there was a lot of composure amidst all the frenzy as Liverpool tried to get another equaliser yeah definitely I mean I think we realised that as soon as we got the winning goal well the, the, the goal to go ahead we just needed to keep our shape and keep compact and we know we're all confident in our own ability we're confident as a team that we can keep that uh, compact and not let them score, which we did really well. And we saw it there, no nerves and compact, won us the game. And your thoughts about the, the quarter-final now? It, it sounds good, doesn't it? It sounds brilliant to be in the last eight, but I think it's um, Leicester or Southampton. So we'll have to see how that game goes. Keep uh, Coaches will keep looking at their games, see the shapes they play, and you know, move on to the next one and try and recreate this performance that we've done tonight.